Um, so um, our work uh, in ontologies for chemists is rooted within the um, uh, NPI for chem consortium, which is the, a part of the national, national research data infrastructure, NFDI in Germany and an, an NFDI for chem. We, we aim to digitize research workflows in chemistry. And an important part of this endeavor is, is of course, the verification of, of data. So the formal semantic description of data to achieve data integration, unification, and, and linkage across uh, various heterogeneous sources. And, and that's where, where ontologies come into place and uh, why we organize uh, the NFC Afrochem Ontology Workshop um, to bring together stakeholders from, from various uh, ontology projects, software projects, and uh, also NFDI consortia. And um, as you can see on the slide, there are more areas we work on, uh, but today we cover only three uh, highlighted elements. Um, the NFD Afrochem Terminology Service, um, providing chemistry ontologies via um, APIs for machine to machine interaction and thus connecting terminology services or the terminology service with other NFDI services like the electronic lab notebooks uh, we develop or data repositories where you can also annotate your data. Um, the terminology service is also a web portal for, for human users um, to search or browse in ontologies. And in the future, um, also hopefully to curate ontologies. That's something we will hear uh, in a few minutes about. And in standards for CAM, we work on, on recommendations for data and metadata standards with uh, international bodies like the IUPAC or RDA um, to, towards minimum information um, of chemical investigations um, to fully describe and annotate research data. So minimum information of chemical investigations, MIHI, uh, that's a short form. And in the repositories for CAM, we develop a common level of operation uh, for a federation of chemistry repositories within NFDI for chem, applying uh, ontologies and the aforementioned standards there as well. Um, so maybe um, you participated already in our first ontologies uh, for chem workshop uh, last September, or um, September 22, actually. And the, the major goals of the, the previous workshop were to gain first an overall overview of, of the landscape of, of chemistry ontologies, and to bring together the, the ontology creators, developers, and service and tool developers uh, within NFDI for chem, and but also uh, NFDI consortia related to chemistry. And we are very happy to have um, participants from uh, at least four, I think, NFDI consortia in this workshop again. Um, overall, we had, a present, had presentations from um, over 10 major chemistry ontologies, uh, the past and current developments. And to name only a few, we had ChemInf, RxNO, CHMO, MOP, Cairo, ChemRov, and EDAM, uh, which all presented their, their uh, history and current developments. Um, a further emphasis was on, on tools and services to work with ontologies, especially workflow tools like Robot or ODK. And um, last but not least, a uh, special focus was also on the application of ontologies. Uh, and tools and data repositories, databases, or electronic lab notebooks um, with the aim to semantify research data. And in the final discussion, participants um, agreed on, on the potential and also the need to develop joint strategies uh, with regards to design patterns, ontology mappings, and, and tool to, to connect, especially con uh, across communities. And um, we have seen first results of these efforts um, at the first conference on, on research data infrastructures, Cordy in Karlsruhe, this, this September, where several projects presented their approaches uh, for ontology development and the integration into services across various um, consortia within the NFDI and across several disciplines. So this was very promising. Um, if you're interested, you can look up the resources uh, from, from last year. So um, the slides of this presentation are linked in the agenda, and then you can follow the links uh, within these slides to uh, have also um, the, the recordings from the last uh, workshop and all the, the presentations we had there. So um, over the next few minutes or remaining minutes, um, I, I would like to provide a brief overview of the 
topics lined up for our two-day uh, workshop this year. We are very grateful uh, for the, the wealth of submissions and presentation proposals we received. So uh, your valuable insights and, and contributions have enabled us to create what I think is a very inspiring agenda, uh, agenda again, showcasing diverse aspects of ontologies uh, in the application chemistry. Um, so um, last year's workshop was, was inspired by, by our NFDI for Chem paper and detailing the, the, the landscape of ontologies in chemistry. And um, many of the ontologies uh, identified in the paper were showcased then in the workshop. And um, today we are excited to provide some, some updates on, on recent developments within the ontology community, notably from KBI and the e nanomapper ontology and ChemInf. And uh, additionally, we will have a, a comprehensive overview and, and analysis from, from the NFDI for CAT, so Catalysis uh, Consortium on ontologies tailored for catalysis research. So it's particularly intriguing as it examines some familiar ontologies, but from a different perspective now. And in the past year, we also have gained um, significant experience in ontology work, both within the NFDI consortia and through our joint NFDI working groups um, discussing ontology harmonization mapping. And today's agenda includes, uh, for example, a presentation detailing our collaborative uh, efforts in ontology development, pooling expertise from uh, both domain experts and ontology specialists. So it's very interesting what we experienced there. And then another is uh, the introduction to user friendly tools um, that allow domain experts to interact with SCOS vocabularies using familiar platforms like Excel and GitHub. And um, a special focus um, we have then on the um, presentation and discussion, um, the IUPAC Gold Book examining its role as a primary source for textual um, definitions in chemical ontologies. And uh, we are particularly eager to hear your uh, opinion and insights uh, on that topic or proposal. Um, we will further have two key presentations that address challenges and, and pressing needs uh, with regards to standardization in the realm of ontologies. Uh, first, uh, metadata for ontologies. So this is uh, an increasingly pertinent area of focus. Um, the ability to find and reuse ontologies uh, is, is paramount when integrating fair data principles into the, the various services and tools. And, um, as we venture into terminology services and assess ontologies suitable for, for our communities. And um, this aspect is, is quite crucial. And here we have a report from, from colleagues from, from chemistry, catalysis and engineering, uh, who share their, their insights and findings. And secondly, um, the standardization of, of chemical prefixes, Curies and um, UREIs, um, Charles will they have there into the pitfalls of, of standardizing uh, the referencing of chemical entities and concepts using um, these prefixes. So I'm looking forward to the insights this session will bring. And um, as last year, we have a strong focus also on, on, on practical applications of ontologies and embedding and services for handling. Uh, research data in particular, and uh, we observe that ontologies are often not used by, by the researchers directly, but instead are embedded into tools used by researchers to annotate the data. Um, or in other words, very often you tend to hide the, the complexity of, of ontologies in, in that tool and these tools so that you don't overwhelm the domain experts or researchers. Um, and we will hear there about um, Suede and Ontomaton, um, two tools. Um, um, which integrate ontologies and, and the metadata annotation process. Uh, also ontology elements, uh, very helpful widgets to be embedded into any web tool providing terms from the API of the terminology service. Also again, to annotate data. And with ontologies for schema.org and the NFDI for chem search service, we'll have, um, or we will see the improved search features based on rich annotated. Okay, so that's very short an overview about the topics for the next two days. And uh, um, I would like to, to end my introduction, uh, introduction actually by thanking you for being here today. So um, um, as we approach the first talks uh, of this workshops, I hope for, for constructive discussions and potential new insights. 
and um, I wish everyone a, a very productive event, uh, six hours over two um, um, days. And uh, we will begin our first talk, Tim and NFDI for Chem, Tim and Service News and Updates, fostering um, the community curation of chemical ontologies um, by Philip Strömert. And uh, Philip, stage is here, you can switch screen.